<laughs> okay, good day, Dino friends. Today I made myself a Lego guy, I guess. I don't know. I know it's kind of a meme, so I thought I'd try it out. I don't know. Should I should I keep this little sir should I keep it? I don't know. I don't know. I will try it out today. I think it will be fun. Anyway, today I wanted to make another dragon adventure video because you guys liked the last one so much So and I've been playing the game quite a lot actually since the last time I made the video uh, Which was on Monday and now it's Friday, which is the last day of the Valentine's event or maybe it's already over I don't know if this video is going to be late So I hope you guys got everything you want from the Valentine's event and I tried to get as many eggs because as I said in the last video I got access to a friend's Jolteon's private server uh, which means that I had free access to get the Valentine's egg which spawns every half hour as you can see here so that means every half hour I got a chance so while I was editing other videos I was just sitting here waiting for it to spawn well this is not the private server of course because there's people's people's everywhere what's that dragon what's you got there oh gosh i can't fly i'm not very good at flying oh that looks cool cool colors so i farmed five eggs or well four because i already had the one valentine's dragon in the last video then i farmed four more eggs and i thought i would uh try to hatch as many as i could at once maybe even 10 but then when i found uh my sixth egg i couldn't pick it up and the game said you cannot have more than five dragon uh you can have only five of this valentine's Valentine egg so I thought okay so I'll just hatch the other ones and then I can pick up more eggs so that's what I did but the game still wouldn't let me pick up another egg so then I thought because I had really bad colors first that's what I have to say I had really bad colors dra uh, Valentine's dragon so I thought what if I just delete them then I can pick up more eggs and then it still wouldn't let me pick up more eggs. So now I have exactly zero Valentine dragons <laughs> because I deleted them. Because I'm a dummy? Because I'm a doofus, I deleted all, <laughs> all five of my Valentine's dragons. But they were—they had really ugly colors. It doesn't matter because then I asked Jolteon, can I please do it on another account? So I did it on another account. So on that account, I now have the five uh, eggs and I put them in the incubator and then I hatched them and I didn't look at them. So I don't know if they have mutations or cool colors. So I wanted to look at those and I also wanted to show what I've been playing the last week or so since the last video. I've been playing this game a lot. I've gotten really addicted to the breeding. So that's when you have a boy dragon and a girl dragon and you make them have a baby. So then you can see what it, it's always such a surprise what you get. So I've been breeding mo almost just the... Um, uh, this one, what's it called? Saurium dragon. It's just my favorite. Just like I started, of course, with my favorite dragon, Erizard. And I started to try to get mutations. So now I have at least one of every mutation. This one is really cool. It has like the neck mutation. I think that's my favorite one of all the mutations that this dragon can have. And also this one has pretty nice colors, I think. Anyway, it's just I've been playing so much around with it. Oh, can I get off? Thank you so much. Okay, so uh, let's get rid of you guys. And also, I got donated some dragons, so let's have a look at those. Um, Jolteon, apart from the fact that I could use her private server, also she gave me uh, uh, snow... I want to say Christmas, but I think it's just called Winter Dragon. It's called... Um, a Tosknir dragon. So I called it Jolly, of course, after Jolteon. So thank you so much to Jolteon for giving me one because I wasn't playing in the winter event and it looks so cool. And it's going to take a while to grow up. So we'll maybe we'll do that in another video. I know it's going to get super big because I've seen other people with it. And also, I've been trying to get mutated versions of the basic starter dragon. I know that is really weird. I know no one cares about the starter dragon, but I think it would be just so cool to have a fully mutated version of every dragon. Just from... Uh, uh, and I just like the breeding to see what happens. So I'm also level 47 now, which is a lot higher. Just, I guess, just from breeding. I don't know what gives XP. Uh, I think maybe feeding them gives XP. Um, and then I got donated dragons by someone called Mr. Temanite from the Discord. I don't know if you guys know him, Mr. Temanite. He's a long time uh, fan of the channel. He gave me this one. Look at it. It's so beautiful. It's like a beetle, like a rhino beetle dragon. Okay, Aristarch, you're kind of blocking the way. I'm going to uh, 
get rid of you for a second. Oh, it is so big. And of course, I couldn't resist to try to make that 1F babies. I gave, I made this 1F babies three times and two of them had mutations. So that's pretty cool. So it had, uh, let's see. So this one had mutations and this one. Uh, oh, no, wait. Don't spawn them inside of each other. Then I cannot see. Okay, so this one has a mutation on the butt. Yeah, I think these spikes that are here, these ones, you cannot really see them that well, but it has spikes here on the back part. And this one has spikes at the front. And I think those are the mutation. I'm not really sure. But yeah, these are pretty cool. I That two out of three of her babies. Maybe I'm just super lucky with this one. Um, I think that's... Oh yeah, and Mr. Temonite also gave me... This dragon and this guy called it Thanos <laughs> because it's purple. It's it's the Th Thanos dragon. Pretty cool. Thank you so much to Mr. Temonite for those dragons and everyone else. Uh, Lego Arduino. Oh yeah. And there's one more super red dragon. Apparently there's a dragon that's like a skeleton dragon, which is really cool. And Lego Arduino actually got one from a friend. And then we tried co-op hatch. So I actually used a starter dragon uh, and he used his super big skeleton dragon. And they had a baby. And guess what? Mine is actually a... It's called Skeletor. Mine is actually a Skeletor. It's still only a baby. But when it grows up, it's going to be like a big skeleton dragon. It has pretty cool colors as well. It has like the uh, like a pink invisible... Oh, excuse me, sir. There's like an invisible pink hair or something or spikes. I don't know who this is. I don't know who this is. I guess... I don't know who this is. Um, anyway, so if we're going to hatch these five Valentine's dragons, we have to go to my other account. So be right back while I reload to my other account. How is this working out, by the way? I feel like my hair is sticking out, so it looks like I'm bald. Hello. Hello. And look who it is. It is our good friend, Extrasaurus. Extrasaurus, my other account. Oh, what is this? Daily login. Oh, on Buildosaurus, I got an egg from the daily login. Volcano egg. And I put it in the incubator. And I totally forgot to show you guys what was in this. I don't know what's in a volcano egg. I'm, I'm, I don't know what's in, I guess, maybe, I don't know. A red fiery dragon. I don't know. Okay, anyway, here we have my other account, Extrasaurus. Um, because on this account, Jolteon also accepted me into the private server. So thank you so much once again. And I hatched the dragons and I didn't look yet at the colors or if they have mutation. Please, it would be so cool if we have one like with a mutation. Uh, okay, I'm gonna check. I'm gonna check. Okay, let's see. So we have Dark Wing, which is... Br Wait, is someone trading me? Someone wants to trade me. What do you want to trade? What do you want to trade? Do you want to want a pink dragon? Is that what you want? What is this? A species agricos. I don't know what that means. Oh, you accepted the trade? Okay, here, you have a free... You, ha you get this. Why are you trading me a free... <laughs> Whoa, thanks. I just obtained another dragon that I didn't have from a random per- Thank you so much who that was. Um, I got- what? Did, which one did I get? Uh, this one. What? It's like white and glow. Oh my god. That is like- that is so cool. Thank you. Random person for giving that to me, I guess. I don't even know what Agricos, what kind of dragon that is, but thank you. Um, anyway, so the other five babies, so not the white one that I just got. The other five are Valentine's dragons. So one is brown and purple. One is uh, dark purple and light green. One is cobblestone yellow, greenish and blue grayish. Oh, I like this color combination, the blue and the white. And black and um, blue. Let's see if one has a mutation. No. <gasps> this one has two muta mutations. I've never had a dragon with two mutations at once before. And this one has one mutation. Oh, this one has two mutations. Yes. Yes. Okay. 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 I'm going to carry those. I've, I've actually in my entire life never had a dragon with two, two mutations. Why can I not say the word mutation? Mutation. Okay. I don't know why I can't, cannot say the word. Okay. So I feel like my head has to be smaller. I feel like my head is way too big for the Lego portrait. I feel like in the Lego games, the portrait, first off, it's on the other side. I know it's on the other side, by the way. I know some of you are going to say it's on, it's supposed to be on the other side, but 
then I, I'm looking this way. If I if I put my face over here and I'm looking, it looks like I'm looking outside of the screen. Wow, look at that! You guys cannot see because I'm looking at the wrong. I'm, I don't want to look at the wrong side. I don't want to look at the wrong side. I don't want to. I, I like it this way. I don't want to mirror it. Okay, I'm going to make it better. Make this channel great again. Did that fix it? Actually, I think it did. Okay. Uh, okay, sure. Sure. Okay, so now I have my head a little smaller. Is that is that better? Is that... It's not in the screen. I feel like in LEGO it's even smaller, but I don't want my face to be like this tiny. I know, I'm spending way too much time on this. Okay, okay, back to the actual video. I have two dragons with mutations. Oh, and I want 10 watermelon seeds. I, I looked in the store and apparently those cost... One seed cost 25k. So it's like I want 20, 250k... Except I didn't, I just have 10 seeds. So I don't know what to do. Like, if you plant them, is that a waste of money? That sounds like a waste of money. Oh, and I have another basic egg. Eh, meh. And the grasslands egg, I think, can only have the starter dragon and the saurium. <gasps> oh, 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 that wasn't fair. I saw it land on the money, and then you quickly made it go to the leaf. That's not fair. I saw what you did there. <gasps> oh, 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 oh. Oh, okay, 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 so one of the mutations, Jolton already had it as well, is the horns. Honestly, I don't want to sound like a picky person spoiled. I don't really like the horns too much of a mutation. Okay, but now we can look at them a little better. Oh yeah, these dragons, if they're a kid, they keep going into the floor. I keep forgetting. Okay, this one didn't have... To oh, this one has the mustache. There's one mutation. Okay, so this one has the mustache and what else? Oh, and it has hair on the back. I think that's a mutation and not normal. So this one has mustache and a hairy back. A hairy back, like an ugly old man, you have a very hairy back. And the other one has... I have to respawn it, it keeps going into the ground. Oh, this one also has the moustache, so the moustache and the horns. That's pretty cool, I think that's... I don't know how rare that is. Actually, today, while I'm recording that, that has to be rare, considering the fact that you cannot breed them yet. I think Jolteon said you can breed them soon. On Friday, so today is Friday, so today, when the update comes that Valentine's is over, after that you should be able to, like, trade them and um, breed them and do whatever you want that you can't do with them, that you can do with other dragons, so yeah. Stop going into the ground! Okay, I hope they fix that too. Stop going into the ground. When they're tradable, maybe I can breed them and give you guys some of the babies, so if anyone didn't get a Valentine's dragon, maybe we can trade them, but you have to be level 25. I'm not a big fan of the colors. I don't know why this dragon makes me so picky, but I've yet to see a Valentine's dragon that makes me go, ooh, those colors are my favorite like I've not, like even with the Valentine potion I was like eh, eh. okay I want to see what dragon this is I have no idea what is a um, agricos agricos okay I want to see did I click equip to arm it's on my shoulder agricos agricos ah I thought I <laughs> okay and equip this one to arms and let's see which one will look like none of these colors are really like mind-blowing good what colors would look good i guess usually i'm a fan of just the normal colors no nothing special in material but i think the valentine's dragon might look better with some kind of either neon or transparency or something else i'm not really sure oh that looks so cool <laughs> what did she give that to me? Because all I gave her was like one of the basic, no, a, a sorium that didn't even have a single mutation. It had pretty cool colors. It was all pink almost, but still, this you gave this to me a glowing for a white glowing version of this. Oh man, it's like my lucky week in Dragon Adventures. People give me dragons. I guess maybe partially because well, it's not because I'm a YouTuber. Because this person, I don't think she knows me. Not a lot of people know about my extra source account, so maybe she was just feeling nice. I don't know, but thank you so much. Or maybe her bags were full. Sometimes you're, maybe she was breeding a lot of the dragon, and then your bags are full, and then you have to delete the dragon, so you might as well give it away for free, I guess. Dude, you have a nice base. 
Foxy334. Shout out to Foxy334 for having a pretty cool base. I like it. Okay, so I guess that is it for this video. I, I was expecting it to be cooler, but I don't know what else to do. I'm hatching the dragons. I guess I can show them again when they're grown up and when I've traded them to build a source. I really need some more space. I wish this game gave you more space for dragons because when you're breeding, you keep getting cool ones that you kind of want to keep uh, at least for a little bit. But if you only have like, I only have 20 inventory space on Builder Source, but even if you have like 50, it still fills up pretty fast. Because when you're breeding, you want to keep the ones with the special qualities. Oh, wait, did I not spin the wheel? Oh, no, that's, this is my other account. Okay, I didn't spin the wheel yet on this account. Okay, we get to spin the wheel again. Give me some something cool. Give me something cool. 500 coins. Wow. I'm such a rich boy now. Such a rich boy. I'm a rich boy. I'm not even gonna look. It's just going to pop up in the corner. And it is 20 max for 5 crystal. Yay, super cool. Wait, is that the same dragon twice? Is that a glitch? Or did you just... How did you get exactly the same dragon twice? Oh, or maybe this is the dragon when it's equipped. And this is just like when it shows on the auction. Or something. I don't know. I don't know. That's my best guess. That is that is That it is the same dragon. Okay, people sell cool dragons, but I kind of don't want to buy dragons because I love the breeding so much. And I want to kind of like have dragons that I bred myself that look so cool, but I don't know. I don't know. I do not know. I always forget to feed the dragon because I, because up until now... Oh, 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 are you serious? That is so... I got this... It's so happy! It is so... I got this for free? Are you serious? It looks so cool. Thank you so much. Shout out to that person. I forgot their name, but shout out to the person who gave me that for free. You're epic. In the end, I just kind of want to keep just one of each dragon. That is, I guess, what would be the ultimate collection? I guess to have just one of each dragon that had that's like perfect, that you would like super much, I guess. <gasps> oh, someone used the Valentine potion on the winter dragon. That's pretty clever. That's pretty cool. That makes it look cool. Unless, wait, is that Valentine color? It's slightly different, isn't it? I don't know, maybe it's slightly different. I'm not sure. Okay, so I'm back on my account, build a source, the one with the zero Valentine's dragons, but I'll trade them. I'll trade them to this account. Or maybe I'll just keep using my other account as like backup inventory space. Maybe that's a clever thing to do. I don't know. Let's see what I get from the volcano egg. I have no idea actually what kind of dragon comes from the volcano egg. Okay, so it's purple. It's called a Numine. Numine. I hope I'm pronouncing it right. Okay, so now I have a Numine and a Skeleton Dragon. I don't know what a Numine is. Does it have mutation? Let's see. It has a lot of health. It has 15,000 health as a baby. Or does, does the health even change if they're a baby or not? I don't actually know. Okay, so... It has no mutation, the element is grass, it's a female, Numine, with person no personality, same, same. Uh, oh, that's the one from the picture, this one I think it is, and also this one I think. Oh, it has a pretty cool thing on its back of its head, like this shape. Okay, so that is it. I feel a little bit overwhelmed because of all the new types of dragons that I got. I was personally, I know it sounds silly, but I was happy with just having Soriums. Just trying to breed the perfect Sorium is what I was trying to do. That's why I have so many of them with the different mutation. Let's see. Oh, this one has no mutation, but that's the one that I used the Valentine's colors on. The Valentine potion last time, so I don't kind of kind of don't want to get rid of it. <laughs> Um, oh man, now I have not enough space to even breed more. Oh, too many dragon types. That's going to be hard because you're going to have to choose which one to delete and it's so sad. Okay, well anyway, that's the end of this video. Tell me if I should keep the Lego portrait if you like it or if I shouldn't do it. I don't know. That's the end of this video. I should put hearts next to it. You know how when you play a Lego game, you also have like, it says how many hearts you have and how much money you have. <laughs> we should put that next to the por portrait. I don't know. I don't know. Uh, tell me if I should do that. And that's it, everyone. Just be careful because I think, I don't know when this video comes out, we're really, really close to 666 subscribers. So... We have to be very careful because the evil army is coming. So everyone look out everywhere for the evil army. That's the end of this video. 
Don't forget to stomp like a dragon. Super big thank you to everyone who supports me as a member on YouTube or a Patreon on Patreon. Their names are on the screen right now. Thank you friends so much. Without you, it wouldn't be possible for me to make these videos. If you also want to support the channel, the links are in the description. And if you don't have any money, you can just share this video and like and subscribe and do all the nice things, especially just be a nice person. Thank you so much. Don't forget to stomp like a dinosaur.